everyone, Amy Love here, and I came on today to share with you these little paper and lace snippets that I just sat and sewed one day. Aren't they cute? I'm thinking they would be so adorable um, as tags or clips or embellishments in journals. They're just so sweet, and I used, um, of course, a bunch of uh, different kinds of lace snippets, and then I used some hymnal paper and some book paper from Angel Dream Crafts Kim on Etsy, and I also used some of the really adorable um, dyed paper I got from Jennifer at A Trace of Sparkle, and aren't they just cute? I love these little snippets. So I made just an incredible amount. I had such a good time just sewing these together one day. So I do have bundles of these available in my Etsy shop and I will have the link to my Etsy shop below. But I want to show you how I used them. I thought I would use them on a canvas as the background. So then I did that and then I made a little bit, a little snippet canvas. It's so cute. So um, I used just um, a hard canvas and I covered the back with this. I covered the entire canvas with these snippets and you can see them all along the edge that's there and peeking off um, on the top and on the side. That is all those snippets I made. And of course I covered up the middle where you can't see. I should have just probably put snippets on the edge and would have saved some, but they're there now. <clears throat> so once I had the canvas covered with the snippets, it was pretty. And I should have taken a picture so you could see just what that looked like. But then I decided that I would add this uh, fabric image right here, which is just such a pretty, pretty image. And then I just kept on with the snippets. So I used tons of snippets from Angel Dream Crafts. And I will, of course, have a link to Kim's Etsy shop below. And I just put them all over, like look at look how pretty that is. And then just various snippets. I tried to make sure to use all different textures and colors. Um, and I just stuck them everywhere. This lace snippet right here is actually a lace that I have in my Etsy shop. If you're interested, I think it's so, so pretty. So once I got all the snippets down, I started to embellish further with um, some rhinestone cup chain here. And here and uh, um, that is available at Kim's shop she also has it in pink if you'd like pink then I created a little snippet flower right here which was actually inspired by these snippet flowers that Kim carries in her shop I love them they're adorable so I created one right here and then dangling from it I used um, a pearl dangle and then I used uh, this pretty dangle that's off of one of her laces in her shop. I just love how it hangs right there This butter this adorable butterfly. Let me see if I can get it in here So cute Kim I don't think has these in her shop right now, but I'm hoping that she'll have some more by spring because It's adorable. So I have hoarded that for a long time and um, I decided to use it uh, on this canvas because I just thought it was so pretty. So I added a shabby rosette right here and some uh, bridal applique coming out behind there. And then um, I put another applique, a beaded and sequined applique here. And then on this uh, lace, I added these adorable pink rolled roses from Kim's shop. I just love them. And then I put one of her cabochons right here. Isn't that just beautiful? And she has such a great selection of cabochons. I love them. So I put that one right there on top of a snippet of uh, my aunt's uh, wedding dress right there. So cute. And then I made... Um, I gathered up this little uh, snippet of lace and then on top of it I added another pink uh, rosette and I um, added some pearls and now these white pearls I got from Angel Dream Crafts. She does carry pearls. Uh, I had this <coughs> pretty little um, dangle in my stash so I added that and I just I love how it turned out. It's so sweet. It was so fun to make. I mean, these snippets just really did make such a great background for this. Adorable. So you can find this canvas and um, packets of these snippets in my Etsy. 
um, and you'll have the link below to that. I will also put a link below to all the other ladies that are on the uh, Angel Dream Crafts design team because they are always inspiring me. So be sure you go and check them out. And I hope you're all doing well. And I am hoping to get some more time to craft here real soon. So I hope to be back uh, maybe next week with another video. I hope you're all doing well. Please leave me a comment and let me know what you think. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, everybody.